Hey guys, welcome to another Azure Everyday video. I'm Mike Davis, the manager of consulting services here at Pragmatic Works, and I wanted to talk to you about the differences between Power BI Pro and Power BI Premium. So I get a lot of questions about this when our clients are trying to get on Power BI for the first time, they may be moving off of a reporting services or some other reporting solution. They've, they've seen Power BI and some of the advantages that you can get from, from using it, and but they're not sure what license they should buy, and it can be confusing looking on the website. Uh, so I'll break it down pretty simple for you here. Uh, but you're between Power BI Pro and Power BI Premium. Uh, Power BI Pro, you are uh, the users are licensed individually. So if you've got you know, 10 people that need to get in there and look at reports and a couple people need to build reports, they're all gonna need licenses for Pro to be able to get in there uh, and view the reports and create reports. But when you buy someone a Pro license, they get the ability to both create content and view content. Um, and so they can consume it and they can put content out there, which may or may not be what you're looking for. Also, if you have a lot of users, uh, then buying individual licenses for each person on Power BI Pro can get quite expensive. So this is where Power BI Premium comes in. So Power BI Premium, you're not buying individual licenses for each person. Uh, you are buying a bulk, basically, for your for your company, and uh, the uh, the people who are creating content will still need a Power BI Pro license to get in there and create content. But your premium features now allow anyone to get in there and view that content uh, that has access to your Power BI Premium. So if you are looking for a, um, you have a lot of users that are just need to get in there and look at content, but you only got a few that need to create content, uh, Power BI Premium may be the way to go. If you've got a lot of users who are going to want to view content and create their own content, uh, they're still going to need that pro license to get in there and create content. You can also do a mix of, of both, of course. Uh, you may buy premium for your, for your whole company and then pro licenses for, uh, for a few individuals also uh, that need to get in there and create content. So that's basically the, the big difference there between Power BI Pro and versus Power BI Premium. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. I look forward to seeing you on another Azure Everyday video. Thanks for watching.